Once upon a time, in the beautiful city of Paris, a young boy named Simon was born into a world of colors and brushes. His father, Laurent Vouet, a painter himself, introduced Simon to the magical realm of art. From an early age, Simon's hands danced on canvas, creating portraits that captured the soul. Eager to explore and expand his horizons, Simon embarked on an adventure that took him across Europe. His first stop was England, where he painted, but his heart longed for more. It was in Constantinople, amidst the splendor of the Ottoman court that Simon's brush first tasted the exotic painting portraits now lost to time. However, it was Italy that truly captured Simon's heart. He wandered through Venice, absorbing its light, and finally settled in Rome, where his talent blossomed. Inspired by Caravaggio, Simon's paintings took on a life of their own, filled with dramatic contrasts of light and shadow. The aristocracy adored his work, commissioning him to paint literary subjects and beautiful heroines. Simon's success in Rome was unparalleled. He painted for the Basilica of St. Peter and was honored with prestigious commissions from Cardinal Del Monte. His work on the cycle of San Francesco marked him as a celebrated artist in Rome. In 1624, he was even appointed head of the Accademia di San Luca, a testament to his influence and talent. But fate called Simon back to France, where he would introduce the Italian Baroque style he had mastered. Alongside his wife, Virginia Vesey, also a painter, he opened an academy of drawing. His return marked a new era in French art, as he adapted the styles of Veronese, Titian, and the Caracci to the grand decorations of the age of Louis the Trave and Richelieu. As the first painter to the king, Simon's influence soared. He painted portraits for Louis the Frenchman and created masterpieces for the palaces of the Louvre, Luxembourg, and Saint-Germain-en-Laye. His work adorned the halls of the powerful, from the Palais Royal to the castle of Malmaison. Simon Vouet's legacy is the embodiment of French Baroque painting. His life was a journey of passion, discovery, and creation. He was not just an artist. He was a pioneer who bridged two worlds, bringing the Italian Baroque to France and forever changing the course of French art. His story is a testament to the power of art to transcend borders and to the enduring spirit of creativity.